Hello everyone, Christopher Beast here, and in today's video, I want to talk about a mod that I released recently for Lies of P, and that is a first-person camera mod for Lies of P. For people who've been following the channel since the beta of Lies of P, I actually made this a version, a mock-up of this idea way back during the demo, um, and I said back then that if this was an idea that proved popular, I would actually make it into something valuable in the full version. And that's where we are now, where a full-blown working version of the mod is in play here. So with that, we're just going to get right into this. So with no more further delay, let's switch just into this. So first things first, to install this mod, you're going to need the Interpose Mod Launcher. All the details to installation are on the Nexus page, which will be linked below. It is not difficult. You download Interpose. Once Interpose is running and good, you just drag and drop, and the file will go straight into the Logic Mods folder, and it should run perfectly fine. There really shouldn't be any issues with setup in this regard. Once you've gotten this set up, all you need to do is hit the Alt and C key, and you will be in first person. The reason that it's bound to a key is because currently there is a plan to add an unbound option to make it so that you can go back to the normal camera angle, and that will probably come in a future update. I think this is a really interesting idea of giving a new perspective. I really love camera mods. I mean, I've made three of them for three different games now, uh, those being Paul World, Signalis, and now Eyes of P. And technically, I made one for Sins of the Forest. But I think it's just a good way to get a different view on what's going on in the game, as well as really just, you know, being able to play around and see things from a different angle. It also makes uh, Wise of P in particular extremely difficult to play uh, because it's already a hard game and now you can't see half of the enemy queues. With this mod, it is something that I'm open to suggestions. If you have any suggestions that you think would improve the mod, let me hear them. But really, there, there's not a lot for me to talk about here. Most of this is just seeing it, observing it. So I'm actually going to let some footage play for the rest of this video of what this mod looks like in action. And hopefully you enjoy this concept. If you do, you feel free to install it down on the Nexus page. And if you have any suggestions, leave them in the comments or the comments of the Nexus page. This has been Chris Revist, and I'll see you all next time.